viewers, I'm thrilled to be here at the Florida Audio Expo in the Legacy Room with Bill Doubleson. Bill, how are you today? I'm very well. Bill, what are you showing at the show here? Well, we have our uh, wide range of stuff here and also have some new technologies we want to cover. Um, we have our Aeros loudspeaker system, uh, which is a bi-amp capable system. And it's open air uh, in the back, uses AMT tweeters. And, and being bi-amp capable, uh, we're able to do some things with DSP that you wouldn't normally be able to do. We have our Focus, which is available in either the Focus or Focus XD format, SE system, or the XD. And the XD has internal power amplification on it. Um, and uh, coming over to here, you'll actually see something for the first time. And this is our uh, IV7 amplifier. Uh, this particular amplifier has seven channels of power. Um, we, we just basically are powering both of these systems off of this amplifier. But it's designed for home theater, mm -hmm. multi-amplification. It's also available in an eight-channel version. Oh, really? A four-channel version and a two-channel version mm -hmm. um, on, by custom order. So, uh, and it uses uh, uh, ASP uh, 1200 modules from Ice Power, which are uh, rated 1,000 watts, so it, they have tremendous output capability. So that's unlimited power prices. Yeah, exactly, yeah. yeah. All you could possibly ask for. Um, we also were using our um, Wavelet processor, which has uh, Bomer room correction technology. Uh, it has n numerous other features. Uh, it, it'll accept analog or digital inputs, and uh, basically uh, it has more features than any preamplifier uh, pre I've ever seen in terms of room contours, mm -hmm. um, and it has a, a, a little app that you can use that you can control everything from your mobile device. Mm -hmm. So it's mm -hmm. pretty slick. Very cool. Well, let's listen in just a minute. Why don't you show us what we have in the other room, and then we'll come back and do some more bills. Let us head to the other room here at the Florida Audio Expo. What are we showing in this room? Uh, I'm going to have Bryce tell you a little oh, bit about Oh, great. Hey, Bryce, how are you? Hey, guys. How's it going? How's everyone doing? Great. <laughs> yeah, this is kind of our little side room here, uh, kind of our monitor studio uh, in here. We've got two different models that we'll be playing in here throughout the day and uh, throughout the weekend as well. This speaker right here, Peter, is kind of our bread and butter uh, monitor speaker. This is our Studio HD. Uh, we've had this model around for many years, and it's been a great product for us. It's mm -hmm. been very successful as well. Uh, that's the beautiful finish here. It it's is. It's natural Look sequili. That. That's uh, gorgeous. Yes. Yeah. Great. And um, on this, over here. Yeah, on the listening wall itself, um, we'll be streaming um, from our computers in this room as well, along with CDs. We've got our calibers here. These are the Caliber XD, so they include 700 watts of internal power with these bad boys. Um, lots of kick, lots of bass mm -hmm. uh, potential with these as well. We are using the wavelet preamplifier in this room as well, but we are not going to be using the um, room correction process in here uh, just because it's such a tight room and these monitors really do a great job mm -hmm. with a small room like that. So we want to display that mm -hmm. in more of a natural sense um, as well. And um, yeah, basically this setup's uh, these all retail under 6,000. These are 5,500 um, in the standard finish as well, and then the studios in the natural superior are 1980 uh, as well in the premium finish as well. Mm -hmm. so, um, yeah, it's a great speaker for really all sizes of rooms. Um, we're really putting a lot of studio work into these. Um, we're going into many um, studios, whether it be more contemporary pop um, and also classical studios as well. Mm -hmm. Use these for um, mm -hmm. reference mixing and mastering. Mm -hmm. Well, they're gorgeous to behold. The fit and finish is impeccable. One of two, beautiful. Well, Bryce, thank you very much for the room walkthrough. Yeah. Bill's going to come next door. We're going to go back to the room. We're going to play some craft work. All right. Sounds great. Let's hey, get thank a you. listen. Yep, you're welcome. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 
bass impact is off the chart. When that bass line came in, when I first heard it, the viewers, you could hear me go, whoa. And that's what you can do with these speakers. You can adjust these speakers for your room. That's correct. How long does it take to do that? Well, actually, the actual setup is takes about the measurement takes about fifteen seconds per speaker. Okay. Uh, but then there's a calculation that goes online, um, which can take up to ten minutes because the algorithm is so complex. Okay. Dealing with each and every reflection. But once it once it's calculated, it downloads it right back into the unit. All the coefficients are there, and all the, everything arrives in sync and phase. No kidding, boy! I'll tell you, this is the future, viewers. Legacy audio, sounding uh, the, the bass, the spatiality, uh, the imaging, just spectacular. Thank you. Thank you very much.